Welcome back to another episode of the Crypto Serpent. If you do enjoy the videos, and don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Ladies and gentlemen, I have been waiting for this day since December 23, 2020. Let me begin this video by saying a huge thank you to the entire Crypto Serpent community. I know it's been long. And long there's been, uh, I know how many ups and downs there have been throughout this, what seems like a lifetime that this case went for, but you never once doubted, you never once thought, you know what, maybe the serpent's wrong, you know, maybe this thing could be a security, maybe, you know, maybe we are going to zero. Where are they, serpents? Where are they? Where are all the haters today? They've disappeared. They have disappeared. Where are they? I can't find any of them on the internet. They've gone into hiding. Today is an historic day. Let's focus on uh, what is going on and what is happening right now because it is historic. This is the biggest lawsuit that the SEC has ever lost. The biggest. It's history. It's historic. This is the first cryptocurrency in the United States to have proper legal clarity. I... I need to pinch myself. I don't actually believe that we're here today saying this. I've dreamed about it and I have thought about what, what would I say to the serpents? So how, how am I going to go about it? So what am I going to talk to them about? What's the first thing that I'm going to say to them when, when the case is over? And today's the day, 14th of July, 2023, not a security. So XRP price spikes 90% as judge rules a token is not a security. And a partial victory for Ripple Labs. Now, the crypto market is trading higher following the breaking news that the United States District Court in the Southern New York has granted a summary judgment in Ripple Labs' case, allowing the XRP token is not a security, which is insane. Now, if you're hearing those noises in the background, my phone has been blowing up since this news broke out. It has been an incredible day so far, and the day has only just begun. Now, the case, which was initially brought forth by the Security and Exchange Commissioner, SEC, in 2020, has uh, been one of the most watched and talked about topics in blockchain history. And the SEC lawsuit sought, for, sought to force Ripple to force offering in the XRP token. Like, I'm not going to repeat. You guys know everything that has happened and how it's all gone, how it's all unfolded over the last couple of years. But the foregoing reason, the SEC motion for summary judgment is granted as an institutional sales and otherwise denied. Defendant's motion for summary judgment is granted as to the programmatic, programmatic sales. The other distribution and license and guarding house sales are denied as to the institutional sales. So, of course, over the coming days, we're going to dive deep into what does the roadmap look like now? Because, you know, literally the market has blown up this morning by 90%. So we need to understand what next, you know, how we're going to go about this and what, what's our role now. It's not a security. It's not a security, you know, like it, it can now finally flourish for what it is, which is an entire, it, which is an incredible ecosystem, a solution to liquidity for so many different banks and institutions around the world. And now it can actually go full throttle in its rollout and its plan and its IPO. And oh my God, there's going to be so much news to talk about. But the crypto markets are booming after historic XRP ruling. It is the talk of the town. Everywhere you go, that's you know that this is the biggest news you're going to see today. If you don't like this type of news, I suggest you turn your Twitters and your TikToks off because it is going to be a XRP day. The you know the social media is already blowing up, and it's only been a few hours. Now Ripple Labs have you know posted this XRP is not a security. This victory for Ripple is a win for the entire industry and a step forward for regulatory clarity in the US. Huge thank you to the team that have, um, you know, fought for justice and uh, justice has won today, for once. Now, Coinbase will re-enable trading for XRP on the, on the XRP network. Do not send this asset over other networks or your funds may be lost. The transfers of this asset remain available on Coinbase and Coinbase Exchange in the regions where trading is supported. So not only has the case, it's not a security, but now all the different exchanges are gonna start relisting it again. And uh, let me tell you, there's been a, some people from Coinbase that have been waiting for a very, very long time to be able to trade it. So let the gates open, ladies and gentlemen. Brad Garlinghouse, 
the most important part of this ruling, XRP as a digital token is not in and of itself a contract transaction or scheme that embodies the how we requirements of an investment contract. This is now a matter of law and not up for trial. What a day. What a day. I, I can't thank you guys enough. You know, without you, this channel wouldn't exist without you believing in, um, you know, my thoughts and opinions about the market and what is going on and what is happening. None of this would be possible. So uh, I really, really want to dedicate this video to each and every single one of you who has stood by the serpent, who uh, watches this channel, who is driving to work and, and listens to my videos. It's such a pleasure to be around you and to support you and to, you know, to, to give you guys my, my thoughts and opinions and for you guys to, um, to appreciate it and to, to get value out of it. So from the bottom of my heart, uh, thank you all so very much. If you do enjoy these videos, and don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. As always, thank you. Look forward to seeing you on the next one.